Uh, the aim is to identify the scientific capacity which is available because uh, the government has been investing a lot into science, technology and innovation and universities is one of the places where they focus. One to build the research infrastructure including the laboratories and uh, the buildings, the, the equipment but also to set up uh, training programs that build the scientific base. The purpose of MOVE is to identify the strengths in each university, uh, what do we have, what capacity do we have in terms of the lecturers, in terms of the, their skills, what capacity do we have in terms of machinery and the student capacity. And then I'm using this now to identify what gaps are there? Because it's not enough for you to have uh, training programs. The training programs must translate into industries. We have the intermediate of now how to shape the research to link it with the national priorities because we have identified the national priorities which we are now going to develop into a roadmap, into a strategic direction. Our council has prioritized three major areas going forward, research and knowledge generation, ICT, and resource mobilization. Honorable Minister, we pride ourselves as a center of excellence in ICT, and we have been providing solutions. So we look forward to getting more support from government as we continue building our research capacity. I'm glad that this year, through the budgeting process, the government allocated us one billion shillings to promote research in the university, and we hope to use that to build capacity and give people money to be able to, to do research.